Hey guys, Avery Wing here. So I came across this place, Lester's Farm Market. So I'm here with... Susan. So uh, Susan, uh, what do you guys do here? So we grow a lot of fresh veggies. As we like to say, fresh veggies turn up every day here at Lester's Farm Market. So we're in pretty good harvest right now. Lots of strawberries getting picked. Okay. Um, so the weather has helped and we have lots of great things on our shelf. Okay, do you think you can show us around to what you guys got here? Sure thing, come on. Okay, let's go guys. It looks like we've got a bunch of tomatoes here and other fruits and vegetables here as well. So it looks like we got a whole bunch of fresh produce here. So um, is it difficult picking all this stuff and like what do you guys major in here on the farm? Yeah, so over uh, throughout our season we grow over 100 different varieties of fruits and vegetables. Mm -hmm. And we are very fortunate to have a fantastic staff. There's about 80 people that we have here to make all this happen. So there's staff here in the market, on our ice cream counter, our you pick, and then we have our kids programs, our fun makers, and then we also have our field staff who do all the harvesting in all sorts of weather. Okay, and you guys major in fruits and vegetables, right? Yes, that's right, but we do also do a lot of other fun things on the farm to have a reason for everyone to visit every season. So a lot of fun on the fall, a lot of fun in the spring. The fall time is probably the best season because we have all the extra vegetables. We do a lot of fun things with hay bales, pumpkins, all that kind of farm hmm. fall fun. Okay, and you guys mentioned you guys working on a maze. Yes, we are. So our corn maze, we just finished it the other day. Uh, so hopefully in a few weeks time, we will have our corn maze ready for people to come and enjoy. That's part of our field of fun. And people love it of all ages. People come and enjoy the corn maze. Yeah, so we just finished our corn maze. So our field of fun should be opening within a few weeks. So that has our corn maze. We have a giant slide there, go on wagon rides. And our flower you pick should also be opening around that time as well. So lots of fun kind of at the end of summer gearing up into the fall where we're gonna have even more fun as well. Okay, so I can pick all the daisies and go, ah. <laughs> Well, it's not just daisies, there's so many other things there. Sunflowers are the biggest thing. Okay. People love coming in and get pictures, and it's uh, really cool to see, especially if the weather works out, um, it's beautiful for pictures. And you must uh, also see a variety of birds picking out the seeds as well. Sometimes, yeah. Sometimes there are the little bird friends coming <laughs> and uh, enjoying the flowers as much as we do. <laughs> and uh, any big things for our Halloween coming up as well? Yeah, so we have our big pumpkin fest. Uh, we do a lot of fun pumpkin things. We do uh, pumpkin people. We do hay bale art. We just basically make it fun. So everything that we loved doing on the farm, uh, we try to have it so that everyone else can experience it as well. And we do actually have a farm hunt. So we have a hunted attraction here on the farm that we have usually mid to late October. As well. Okay. And people can uh, not uh, can buy tickets online or in person only? In person. Oh, okay. Yeah, in person. Because it, it, we're in Newfoundland and all those activities are outside. So okay. it's all very weather dependent. Okay. So it's uh, always check us out or give us a call. Um, check us out on social media, sorry. And then that way you can see what areas are open and what the deal is for the day. And uh, yeah, then you can come have fun with us. Okay. Now let's try uh, some of this produce and see how it tastes, okay? Sounds good. So here we go, guys. We're going to try these nice, uh, beautiful strawberries. One for me. And you pick one as well. All right. Cheers. Cheers. Oh. It's just look how juicy those are. They're very nice and tasty, fresh. Mm -hmm. Anyway. The very best. <laughs> uh, you said some, it had some animals here. Do you want to show around? Yeah, sure. Okay, cool. Have this we have all these greenhouses here and all that sort of stuff. Mm -hmm. A whole bunch of beautiful scenery as well. So we got some silly goats here. Yes, this is Selena Gomez. And then this one here is Ivy. Hey, Ivy. And they love visitors and head scratches. <laughs> And they got a whole bunch of other animals here. I see like there's a pony down over there. Let's go let's take a look. We have a nice little pony right here. And uh, he or she? Uh, this is Jovi. And he's named after Bon Jovi because he has Bon Jovi like here. Okay. And he is almost 20 years old. Oh, wow. My cat just turned 15. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> and we got some llamas. Well, these are actually alpacas. Alpacas? Yes. Yeah, so they are cousins to llamas, but a little bit smaller. So this is Duncan and Campbell. Okay, I thought they were baby llamas, but no, okay. No, no, yep, just little dudes. Ah, nice. Oh, I'd like to thank you, Susan, here over on Lesser's Farm. And uh, you guys are located over at? 173 Brookfield Road. Cool, and uh, yeah, guys, so uh, stay tuned for Halloween festivities in the future and all the other stuff they have planned for probably one more wonderful things in the summer, right? Eh? Oh yeah, lots of fun happening over here. <laughs> Peace out guys. As always, keep on gaming, have fun. See you guys on the road.